Any questions or comments? I, that, uh, I was just going to say that um, what you just said about all of the techniques, and I, I'm and I'm learning them all, and I'm practicing them all. Yet they all seem to go in one painting, oh. and I go, "You got to stop that." <laughs> you know, <laughs> pick pick something. But I I um I tend to put them all in. I obliterate it, and it's like starting a different painting every time. And I I it makes makes me crazy sometimes because I think what you just did was probably semi okay, but now I've thought of another technique. And so I, I obliterate whatever I just did. And so I have, you know, I have lots of layers. But Do you but do it, multiple it, painting throws at a time? Um, I do. I've, I've worked on those, um, you know, the 12 by 12s. I, I have a whole wall over there of um, 12 by 12s, but, but, I look at them as just starts, you know, it just starts. And so yeah. now I have to go back and, and, and keep at it. And, and I don't mind it. I love it. And I, I just know that with each day, um, it all begins to settle in. You know, it's like an explosion at first. And then the more you do it, the more you settle down into it. And like you've been saying, Pam, you, you figure out what it is. I love that for me was just huge. I go, I do something, go, well, love that. And then I do something else. And I don't know. So it's, it's um, just trying to settle it all down and just pick a few and do it. So, yeah, thanks for thanks. sharing that. Um, I think we're all kind of technique junkies. And um, while it's really great to learn a technique, uh, it, I, there, part of it for me is like, um, if you like the result, are you willing to to put in the time to make that technique like really, um, you know, because technique takes practice. So do you want to practice, practice, practice to get that result? Now, maybe that that's one question because it's going to take you some time to master any technique. Um, but, you know, in the end, we will never master every single technique we've ever learned. And just, re just like letting go again, it's letting go like, okay, you know, I, I took this in that workshop and I learned this and that, or maybe I learned that medium. And, uh, I think part of identifying what you love is when you don't do it, you miss it. Or when you do these other things, something's lost, like the energy has gone or you're not as motivated. You're like, Oh, I got to do this again. You know, I remember this, you're doing something and you're not really, you like the result, but you don't like the process to get there. Uh, and that's a really good sign that, you know, um, maybe a little bit more thinking about uh, the processes that really make you happy. Like for me, um, because I love what we were doing today, this is so me. I can just tell you that because it has the marks I love and the crazy, you know, being able to start with circle, triangle, square. I mean, I can do that. I am happy because it's like, I can be a kid again because I can sit, I, I don't have to think. And these shapes are so simple yet. So complex. Whenever you get kind of a twofer where it's like, you can start simply, but get something really awesome. Um, and to top it off, like this on one day, I would say that this painting has um, grown a lot, like in its lifespan, um, it's gone through like three layers now. Um, it's an Oliver pattern. Uh, it's got a Pollock sort of feel to it. It's got a Motherwell sort of feel to it. <laughs> like a lot of the artists I admire, not because I was trying to be like them, but because I was trying to be me. And because I'm inspired by these artists, if you're doing a process that you love, um, all those things that you love may hopefully, you know, eventually come into that, that process that, uh, it just makes you happy. Right. And yeah. Oh, we've got a question from Mary. Okay. Hi. Hi, I'm going to have to leave here pretty soon. But I just had so much fun playing today. I made in the comments that we should call these our play dates, just like yeah. our grandkids. Hit. <laughs> play dates. Um, let me turn my camera. I'll just show you what I did today. And it was very spontaneous, very fast. But I, I handled the, the um, you know, the, the, pro the problems in all different ways. Yeah. And it was just so much fun to be so liberated. And yeah. I didn't stick with just black yeah. and white. But, you know, I guess that's me. Yeah. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And it was a fun day. Um, I'll finish watching the video. Um, 
so I don't miss a, miss a beat on this. And <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you, Mary. I love your work today. Good job. Here, Hi. Hi, Mary. Thanks for joining us. Uh, I'm not sure why, but um, I see uh, your thing, which is so it's it's so or uh, in order. Oh. <laughs> and I had the plan to be a little bit organized too, but I um, it's it's just a mess. Ooh, all over ooh, but look. very cool well everybody's going to get a different effect with this uh this business here you know but did you enjoy it did you have fun yeah oh my gosh marie that is so cool oh yeah but, uh, it's it's huge yes it is huge is, is yeah. this like the biggest thing you've ever done oh. it's yes it is it is uh i think uh, it must be taller than me it, <laughs> it, it doesn't say a lot. <laughs> it's it's uh, um, I'm not sure how to how to uh, make it coherent because it's okay. all over. Well, yes, it is. Okay, so uh, the way to look at it is like uh, in any stage of a painting, you know, you're gonna have feelings toward it. Um, sometimes they're good feelings, and sometimes sometimes they're like, oh my gosh, I <laughs> what a mess, right? And um, that's kind of the way we all are kind of learning to just embrace whatever it is. So when you don't know what to do next, um, and, and especially when you've got an all over value pattern, you've got kind of a third in, in our case, like in my case, I've got black and white. I have no midtones. In your case, I think you've got midtones there. So that, right? Um, I, I think maybe I'll, I'll go to high key on this one. Well, you could, but you know, as before you do anything, Marie. I want you to spend a lot of time staring at it and just, just looking at it because I mean, I can even see, and it's even blurry in the zoom, uh, you know, because it's zoom, but there is so much interesting interaction between the fact that you actually do have three values there. Uh, it's, it's much more like complex and I see faces, I see people. Um, and you have to ask yourself, like, what do you see? And then yeah. of what you see, because it is an all over pattern, do you want to keep it an all over pattern? Do you want to uh, change the composition drastically? But give this one time to really like live with this for quite some time, because number one, it's on a larger scale than you've ever worked before. It's, it's only black and white and you've got, you know, your value pattern. I mean, you don't have to convert to black and white. Uh, I would ask yourself, like, when I look at this painting, what jumps out to me first? Because um, when, when it feels kind of like, I don't know what to do next. And you ask yourself that one question, um, like, let's say you say, well, my eye kind of goes to this shape and, and then it goes here and then it goes there. Um, you might start to see that, 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 that the form of navigation you've set up for yourself is either working better than you thought it would. Like the fact that you have navigation, you're not just like, overwhelmed with like, no, I don't go anywhere. So if you kind of like the fact that the navigation is starting to set up, you might say, okay, I start in the upper left. I want to make that a little bit more obvious. So let me make that upper left a little bit more obvious with shape. Maybe I'll make the shape a little bit wider, a little bit like higher contrast. Um, uh, I think with anything, uh, time is probably the most important thing you can give your painting and give it a chance to talk to you because I think it'll talk to you. I really do. 